Yeah, definitely. I think um, the funding support, you know, sometimes is really helpful to do um, pilot trial or pilot work where you can get that initial findings and um, work out the effectiveness of a program, which then facilitates and helps you um, to get larger funding um, for a bigger project. Um, it allows us to be able to support the community um, in evaluating their programs um, and, and seeing that they work and, and allowing those programs to, to continue to develop and prosper in our communities. Um, and it's great as an academic too, to be able to um, do that research that's, that's moving the literature and the research field forward um, so that we can identify um, new areas that we may need to intervene with or better understanding uh, suicide risk um, in young people, in adults, so that we could help uh, this population and hopefully reduce suicide in our community. I think it's absolutely critical that research into eating disorders continues. Um, while our understanding of eating disorders has improved a lot, there's still so much work to do in terms of translating this into effective treatment options. And I think just because oxytocin nasal spray wasn't the answer for us in this instance, it doesn't mean that we should give up on trying to find more effective treatment options. Rotary is doing really such wonderful work in supporting mental health research so I really want to thank Rotary for doing the great work that they're doing. Well I think it goes without saying that I would not have been able to finish my PhD um, and all of the projects associated with it without the support from Australian Rotary Health. Having that support of the Ian Scott Scholarship means that I could purely focus on my research um, and all of the work that's involved. So I think when you fund a PhD student you're providing a researcher with the opportunity to focus on a particular topic for three years. And it means that researcher can really make a difference and a contribution to creating new knowledge on areas within mental health. And basically that's how we, how we progress and how we improve things. Um, so yeah, it's, it's, it, it, it's absolutely been um, you know, fundamental to my success as a PhD student.